Hey everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Octonet Free. We are in the final dungeon, so... Well... Who knows how close to the end of the game? And we seem to have combat right away? Yep, sure enough. Doesn't look too exciting, but this does give us a chance to... pick our... final party? End game party? Uh, okay, so we do have Elk here. Who is level 70, interestingly. Also, he's hurt. I guess he must be hurt from the last time we used him. Or the one time we actually used him. Uh, during some earlier mission. I don't remember if he was level 70 already. I, don't, I would say... Probably not. Which makes me wonder why he, he chose level, to be level 70 now. The only other character with exactly that level is Spellheart. So maybe he just picked Spellheart's level? But seems to make little sense. I don't know. Maybe he was level 70 before. Either way, uh, you cannot change his equipment, and I mean, it would be nice to, to take him for, you know, old time's sake. But then again, I already have only four possible character slots. I mean, I guess for the time being I can take him over, say, Bellheart. <clears throat> I definitely want Henrietta to get some extra levels. I might even do some some grinding, if you will, uh, once I come across a room with uh, healing and save point. You know, mostly healing, of course, because we can't leave the dungeon at this point. Um, just to make her, I don't know. I mean, I mean, right now she's kind of vulnerable. Um, also, her damage is decent for her level, but not really. Not quite on the same level as some of my other characters. <clears throat> so here. Speaking of level 45, 40, yeah. And I would just like to see what her stats, how her stats compare, you know, to the other characters. If I can bring her up to a, to a similar level within a reasonable time frame. But for the time being, let's just explore this dungeon. I guess I'm gonna show this first combat off, and unlike, uh, unless uh, later combats look interesting enough, I'm most likely gonna skip them. I mean, really? I don't even wanna fight enemies with any anyone else. I guess I'm gonna see what he can do. Strike power. That's nice. That's definitely nice to have. Still, I don't. I'm not sure I can make room for him on the final team. I guess I'd rather take Theo to use some awesome monster cards. I mean, I hmm, technically I I have to use Theo before that before uh, because I have two open slots for monsters <clears throat> that I should probably fill just so that uh, that he has interesting things to do during the final combat. Well, anyway, let's take a look at his signature skill. Wow, that does look pretty powerful. It <laughs> deals hardly any damage, though, despite his level. <coughs> See if you can finish him off. Well, uh, the gas clouds, yes. So that's something. <laughs> I was gonna say, you can level up any time you want now. Yeah, whatever, let's just finish these fights quickly and... Oh, and level up, I guess. Sure, why not? Plus two attack, always nice. <clears throat> uh, okay. Not sure what that was supposed to do. And the melee attack is hardly any better. I mean, it's actually worse than the fire attack before, but that might also be because he's using a flame saber against a living flame type enemy. I mean, he was also using fire magic against that same enemy, so maybe I should not judge his his damage capabilities based on that. Wow. Okay. 
okay, so is this just gonna be a gauntlet of simple fights that soak up my time? Hmm. I mean, it, these enemies are also not, not high level or anything, so... I don't feel particularly inclined to capture any of these. <clears throat> yeah, I mean... Huh. Well, 55 Necromancer now. <coughs> Oh god. Ah, now I'm beginning to doubt my decision. Uh, maybe I'm gonna... I'm just gonna take Theo along, or I could back out. But that would bring me right back to the previous combat. Me. I wanna at least see what's at the end of this corridor here. And I guess, as I said, I'm going to... Or, you know what. If I actually go ahead and try to kill enemies quickly, instead of trying my best to, um, to give any other the, the kills, this should be over pretty quickly. Huh. Okay, so these ghouls are more healthy than I thought. <clears throat> Let's see if she can deal 88 damage. Kind of doubt it. Oh, wow. Never mind. Yeah. Can you counter attack? Oh, yes, you can. Okay, so his attack doesn't suck as much. In fact, I mean, it's okay given his level. His selection of skills is not the greatest, but he does have several attack spells and and a buffing spell. Also, I mean, it's a bit early maybe to conclude that, but this might be another um, another enchanted no, what, what were they called? Um, well, uh, ruin situation where the dungeon is. Uh, teleports you, and maybe only one of these three paths uh, doesn't loop on itself. <clears throat> maybe I should start drawing a map or something. I was wondering, just from the look of this... Um, yeah, this time though, I'm gonna skip this dungeon and we'll see what happens once I try to go south from here. Alright. And that brings us back to the corridor, yep. Okay, so much for that. Uh, let's try... Hmm, I don't know. The middle seems to be the obvious path forward, so it's probably not. Oh. Or maybe I'm wrong. Okay, never mind. Maybe this first intersection is relatively simple. Hmm. Wait. You guys? Um, okay, I'm not even going to comment on how, how little sense this makes. Customers already? This is great! It's that goofy family again. Hey, it looks like they're all here too. But how did you get out here? Ah, that's a family, er, uh, secret. We decided this would be a great place to open the shop, so we came. Sure. And you happen to be our first customers. Yeah. Our whole family is here to serve you. Just just ask for whatever you need. Okay. I mean, it's nice. It's it's also I don't know. Kinda of funny that the game doesn't even bother trying to give me a, a uh situation uh, uh, um, an explanation that makes sense. Because there isn't one. Sure. <clears throat> Something, yeah, that prevents abnormal statuses. It's certainly nice to have, such as the equipment that everyone has. I mean, really, at this point, um, who needs any of these individual status preventing things? Well, there's the inn I was asking for. So maybe 
The corridor on the right is really just for, for leveling up. Less, some last time leveling. Last minute leveling. Well, this obviously provides you all the... <coughs> all the usual facilities. Oh, what? What's this? Deepak's was What? Deepak Monster Card? Are you kidding me? Uh, uh monsters. Is it? Got the carpet, haven't used it, yeah. Um, okay. Oh. So much for strong monster cards. I don't know if he's gonna be particularly strong, but I guess I'm gonna use him. Definitely. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, whatever. What could possibly be passed here? Oh, of course. <laughs> it would be funny if I could also just use that then. And does this loop as well? It does not, in fact. Interesting. Okay. <clears throat> well then, I guess I might as well save the game here. Since I haven't done that in a while. Um, sure. Back to position, man. And women. Huh. So, I mean, technically I could use this opportunity, as I said, to give Henrietta some extra levels, but I really want to push forward now and not pause for however long it takes. I mean, this dungeon must be longer, right? It's... There has to be more to this. Terror trial. Oh, okay. I don't know how much of a trial this is gonna be, but... Uh, I guess I'm gonna switch out Alex for Theo here, and see if any of these monsters seem high level enough to, to be worth capturing. Probably not. <laughs> okay. Silly of me. These are... and silly of the game. I mean, seriously? Wild Dogs level 13? 47 hit points? What kind of trial is this? Maybe a try not to laugh. Uh, well, whatever. Let's get it over with. <laughs> she got a little love from that. Yep, sure enough. Well, it's, it really doesn't matter. Even Henrietta is hardly gonna get any experience from these fights. Maybe from that one. If she can finish them off, which... Mm, she might have trouble doing. Platinum Pressure tends to do the most damage, I think. Uh, not quite enough, though. Yeah, whatever. Just in the interest of not wasting too much time here. Yes. Well, let's try the left side first. Another feral trial, or oh no, this must be another looping situation. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Let's take her because she can potentially attack several enemies at once. Or, of course, I could do something like this. Um, well, it's gonna hit three enemies regardless. So, uh, Yeah, give me all these low-level items. Or that one. <clears throat> I 
の毒だけど参考になるわね So left was apparently incorrect I mean I would like to double check and go back down and see if that actually brings me back but I'm going to assume that that it would because if I'm correct that would mean that I need to do this fight one additional time of course <clears throat> okay so right seems to be correct right seems to be right hmm I assume that none of these fights or none of these enemies are going to be particularly high level. Yeah. I mean, it's sometimes hard to tell just from looking at the enemies, but. Um, you know. Occasionally, high level enemies share sprites or look very similar to very low level enemies, but. Seems to be a theme with these trials here, these so called trials. That um, they're not actually. They don't actually have any high level enemies. Um, Alright, that, that could actually work, except. It doesn't. No, they are too far away. Ah, whatever. I hardly ever use this. <clears throat> okay. So left will bring me back to the feral trial. I guess it could technically be down, but most likely not. Let's try up. Yep. So right enough. With these enemies, I'm not sure. That Firebird could be kind of high level. Let's see. <clears throat> uh, 51 isn't bad. 54 is better. Is this Suzaku? Uh, yes. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna try and capture that one. I can always just use them up later if I see something more worthwhile. <coughs> it's also nice of him to pick the exact right target. Nice. Nice, nice. Oh wow, the gatekeeper. No, don't don't kill yourself. Okay, good. Perfect. <laughs> Level seven rock. Please just get countered. <laughs> okay. So now, which direction to pick? Hmm. It could be up or right again, but let's try left. Because why not? Yep. So right, up, left. After this, it's gonna be difficult. Now it could really be anything. Ah, <clears throat> uh, sure, whatever. Does not matter who I pick here. This should probably kill them all. Or almost so. 
れで最後だ準備はよろしくてよプラチナプレッシャーあらごめんあとまつうん Well. I don't think it's gonna be down, although it could be. Right, up, left. Should it be left again? Let's try left again. Nope, that's the floor trial again. At least it doesn't, like, reset me to the first room again. So that's nice, at least. I wonder, can you back out of this room? No, but backing out, backing out is not an option, so it can, can only be up or down. <clears throat> I mean, uh, <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Man, this cold. Quite annoying, I can tell you. Um, so I could, I could back out, of course, but that's not gonna help. I'm gonna try up next, just because uh, I seem to remember from the from that other on Euclidean ruin. Um, that well, I, I drew I drew, drew the grid of rooms, even for these sections that looped in on uh, on themselves. Um, and the the path ac never actually. Well, rooms never overlapped, so technically going down here should bring you back to the to the beginning, but I don't think it will. So let's try out. And it was correct. Okay, that was much easier than expected. I mean, I guess technically it could have taken much longer. Uh, let's just save over this one. I should be able to go back easily enough. <clears throat> nice, okay. It just continues from here. Fifty-one, fifty-four. Hmm. Skull Knights. Tempting. Uh, in terms of capturing, but I don't really know... Well, you know what? I, I might actually capture one of these. The thing is, I'm I'm not sure. Uh, some of my monsters, specifically, um, well, I've ha I've held on to the crystal gago for forever, but honestly, uh, the paralyze could be interesting in a fight against strong normal enemies, but there just are no strong normal enemies. They haven't been in, like, half the game. <clears throat> Even when some enemies are able to deal significant, significant damage, I can always heal them, no problem, and kill them even more quickly, so... There's really no reason to hold on to this. Um, the Master Golem, I'm, I don't know, it sounds strong, but I don't even remember what level it was. But most likely also 50-ish, 50, maybe even 60. So I guess I'm gonna use this up and replace it by something <clears throat> more useful. AKA something that actually deals damage. <clears throat> Which I don't think this does. Or maybe it does also do that. Probably not a whole lot. Yeah, no damage at all. I mean, paralysis can be super powerful, I suppose, but... It's definitely not gonna work against the final boss, or any kind of boss. And, you know... Oh, hey, that did not even kill you. Eh. Henrietta can finish you off next time.
Okay, now. Three possible directions. Um, it could be a mirrored version of the previous section, so it could be left this time. And it's not. Okay. Well, I'm gonna pause here and skip this fight real quick. Okay, next up. I would like to try it right but, I don't know, I feel like up is more likely at this point. And it's not. God damn it. Oh well. Well then. Let's try right this time. Mecha trial. Okay. Hmm. I never tried to cartridge one of these stationary guns. But depending on their level, I might not even want to. Level 19. 14. Ah, okay, well. So much for that. <clears throat> this might be a quadruple kill here. Yep, sure enough. Well, that at least makes this trial too uh, easy to, to deal with. Okay, so it was right again. I mean, I guess it could technically be down at this point. It would not collide with any of the previous rooms. But it feels weird to to go back. You know, going down seems seems to go backwards. So let's try right again. Power trial. Okay. So this time it's right twice. <clears throat> With some, I mean, power trial. What does that even mean? It's an interesting mixed selection of enemies here. An Ogre Lord 53, almost worth capturing, or I mean, technically worth capturing if I didn't have already. Uh, didn't have a quite diverse and powerful selection of enemies already. Hmm. Maybe I should try to not have Alec get all the kills here. <coughs> I also... I'm not sure I ever used Giga Plasma, actually. Giga Plasma. Okay, that is reasonably powerful. <clears throat> wow, these things can move fast. Um, If I damage this Hemogen here, and we might be able to finish off both it and the Golem. Still not enough to level up. Yeah, it's definitely slowing down significantly, <clears throat> since she, she is getting close to the average level of these enemies here. Um, yeah. Oh, wow, it's... Okay, yeah, I didn't... I hadn't damaged it before. There we go, though. Nice counter. <clears throat> Alright, so we had... We had to head right... Twice now. Hmm, it could be going down this time, but... Let's try out. Nope. So maybe it is down. Hmm. But you know what this means. Let's pause. Okay, let's try down. It is a dragon trial. Okay, cool. Hmm. Now I wonder. These are definitely high level. I think those are gold and silver dragons. Hmm. Oh, wait, they're not. That's one silver dragon. He is 58, though. He or it. 
guess I should not assume it's gender. Um, I think I want to use up one of my cards that I know are lower level to uh, in favor of the dragon. Hmm. Skull Knight is 50... what? 50 something? 54. As is Suzaku, I think, right? I think they're both 54. I have no idea. Take back classified. Okay. Multi attribute breath. Drops heavy pieces of gold. I mean, that's just so awesome. Piercing arrows of light. Enormous fireballs. These all sound great. I really wish I had more slots available. Um. I don't know. I think lamest of them all might be the skeleton. Yeah, I think I'd rather have a silver dragon. I mean, we're gonna see this animation regardless, but I think we actually have seen this before. So this is the, the best candidate to replace. Okay, platinum pressure should be able to finish off that damaged dragon there. Actually, both of these maybe. Or maybe not. Yeah, the silver dragon is hardly scratched. Oh, this could be bad for Henrietta? Well, not that bad. What's kind of bad is that I don't think Theo will be able to reach the silver dragon. Although I could be wrong. So, you go ahead and cure. <clears throat> okay, maybe if she moves out of the way. Okay, you damage that dragon a bit more. Uh, that's not as much as I was hoping. Okay, you could have reached either way. Let's go. Oh, nice. I did not expect this to work right away, but that it did. Now you can use this again. Might even apply the what's it gravity effect, mm. or just kill that other dragon. That works too. <coughs> okay, counter it. Now she should definitely be able to. Henrietta uh, is should definitely be able to finish it off next time. You need to do some curing here. Um, 50, yeah, but you can definitely use some light arrow, for example, to hurt the other one. Not bad. Still way too strong to actually finish off, probably, although... Could be close. Oh, I think that worked. Yeah, nice. That should definitely be worth a level up, yeah. So, it was right, right, down. Going left? Doesn't make sense. Up is not an option. So it could only be... Uh, down again. Or right again. Let's try right. And that was correct. Okay, cool. Oh, I also almost missed these. Flame fragment. Yeah, I mean, whatever. Strength element. That's decent. Although, <clears throat> um. <clears throat> That's the one that gives 10 strength? No. No, it's not. Never mind then. Okay. Third four. Oh, this is looking a bit damaged here. As it should be. I mean, it, it crashed once. Let's see what this corridor is all about. Three. Four options? 
and one way back. Hmm, interesting. Oh, maybe this... I haven't... I have a suspicion here. <clears throat> okay, first of all, we have a battle on a bridge. Although, no, oh, this could still be it. Let's see if I... If I end up being correct. I say because, well, basically, as I just found the... Oh, gold dragon. Hmm. I mean, I'm personally more fond of silver than gold, honestly. So I'm, I think I'm okay with keeping the silver dragon. Dragon master seems interesting, although I don't think you can capture this humanoid monster anyway, so... Let's just... Let's just kill these guys. Um... Maybe with the Giga Plasma. Wow, yeah, that just deals so good damage. Such good damage. <clears throat> um, so as I just found the... What was it? A flame fragment or some kind of upgrade material? Um, I was thinking... I mean, in order to even use that at this point... Um, <clears throat> you'd have to return all the way to the, to the strange family. And who would, who in their right mind would do that at this point? So maybe the game actually does offer a way, a quick way back. Which would work via that previously empty room behind the family. Um, how close are they? Not close at all. So far away, in fact, from being dead, that... An impulse bomb might not kill them. It's most likely not kill them. Yep. <clears throat> now, anything she does will definitely kill them. I'm gonna hold off. The problem is that... Hmm, I don't really have a way to... damage them. For Henrietta to kill. Um, she will not reach... Well, she will reach one of them. Diamond Shower will actually reach both. Although... It it's unlikely to kill them, I think. Oh, well, it killed one. <clears throat> and the dragon... Oh, could have killed itself there. Okay, um, sure, whatever. <clears throat> Wait, it's still alive. How did it survive? I thought it had about a hundred hit points before. Maybe I was wrong about that. Anyway. I also can't believe that we're at 38 minutes already. That's that seems crazy. Last time I looked at the timer we were at like twenty. Holy crap. Hmm. I mean, if this does prove to be a way back... No, it's not. Huh. I could have sworn that uh, a teleport would appear here. This seems like the perfect position, too. Hmm. Well, now I don't know what to do. I guess I'll... Oh. Okay, so the leftmost... Hmm. Let's see what this leads. Not combat, interestingly. Huh, okay. Can't go through there. <clears throat> the wind fragment. Hmm. I mean, there must be a way back to the to the entrance eventually, right? We have... Okay, so this is... This turned out to be the way forward. Of course I want to at least check out the other options there. Oh, wait. This might be it. Well, I thought there was going to be some kind of confirmation, but I guess not. <clears throat> Good thing that it goes both ways. Yep, this is what I thought. Okay, cool. That's actually perfect. Because so the fact that that teleport hub is there, because obviously there are going to be more teleports later, 
means that <clears throat> means that uh, the dungeon is actually going to be at least a bit longer. I was worried here that I that was coming up to the end of the episode with maybe only a little bit left, maybe only the final boss left. Although, I mean, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world to have that as a separate video, but I'm gonna save the game here. And I guess, I don't know, it really doesn't matter. I might as well save over here. So long as I keep one save, save uh, file from before entering the final dungeon. Not that I plan to ever go back, but you know, just in case. Um, yeah. Anyway, we're gonna con continue, resume our exploration of the third floor first, and then beyond that. And see how much longer this dungeon actually is. Uh, for the time being, I thank you very much for watching, as always. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment, and I shall see you real soon. Bye-bye.